Good morning, my fellow Disney fan. I'm your host, Dingus Springus, and welcome to episode two at Disney at Dawn. So today we have two topics to talk about. The first one is everything coming to Disney Plus in July, and the second one is when I think the High School Musical, the musical series, season two trailer is going to release. And also guys, let me know in the comments any topics you want me to talk about on the next episode of Disney at Dawn. Currently, we're a little bit dry on Disney news, so whatever you want me to talk about Disney-wise, let me know in the comment section down below. And also let me know any way that I can improve this show and make it more enjoyable. So first up here, we have everything that is coming to Disney Plus in July. I'm going to go through the whole list first, and then I'm going to touch upon the movies and shows that I think are notable. So on July 3rd, we have seasons one and two of Animal ER, Diary of Wimpy Kid, Roderick Rules, Ice Age Collision Course, Ice Road Rescue, season one to four, Race to Witch Mountain, 2009, The Big Green, The Mighty Ducks, Hamilton, It's a Dog's Life with Bill Farmer, Pixar in Real Life, Disney Family Sundays, new episode. One Day at Disney, new episode. On July 10th, we have Season 1 of Crater Fixer's Country Vets, X-Men Days of Future Past, Gigantosaurus Season 1, Secrets of the Zoo Season 3, Solo A Star Wars Story, It's a Dog's Life with Bill Farmer, new episode, Disney Family Sundays, new episode, and One Day at Disney, new episode. We also have on July 17th, a pre-opening report from Disneyland, X-Men Apocalypse, Diary of Wimpy Kid The Long Haul, Disney Junior Music Lullabies, Lost City of Machu Picchu, Super Robot Monkey Team Hyperforce Go Season 1 to 2, The Mouseketeers at Walt Disney World, Wild Chili Season 1, It's a Dog's Life with Bill Farmer new episode, Disney Family Sunday's new episode, and One Day at Disney new episode. On July 24th, there's Wild Congo Season 1, Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Men Tell No Tales, Wild Sri Lanka Season 1, and then a new episode of Disney Family Sundays, and also One Day at Disney. And then finally, on July 31st, we have Alaska Animal Rescue Season 1, Animal Showdown Season 1, Best Job Ever Season 1, Big Cat Games, Cradle of the Gods, Destination World Season 1, Dr. Oakley, Yukon Vet Season 8, Fearless Adventure with Jack Randall Season 1, Hidden Kingdoms of China, Hunt for the Abominable Snowman, The Incredibles 2, India's Wild Leopards, Jungle Animal Rescue Season 1, King Fisher Season 1, The Lost Temple of the Inca, Marvel Funko Season 1-2, to Surviving the Mount St. Helens Disaster, Weirdest, Bestest, Truest Season 1, what Sam Sees, Season 1, Muppets Now, new episode, and also new episodes of Disney Family Sundays and One Day at Disney. So I think this is a great month for Disney+. Plus. I think, to me, the most notable coming in July are, one, obviously, Hamilton. Gotta watch that. There's also going to be, on July 3rd, to me, Diary of a Kid, Roderick Rules. The first three Diary of a Kid movies are really awesome, in my opinion. I grew up with them. I love them. They're fantastic. I'm really happy to see them on the service. Also, Race to Witch Mountain. I remember loving that as a kid, so I'm definitely going to check that one out again. Then we also have on July 10th, X-Men Days of Future Past. One of the best, if not the best, X-Men movies finally coming to Disney+. Plus. This is what I've been waiting for. Since Disney Plus was first announced, I've been waiting for this day. I've been saying that it's going to be just the greatest service because it's going to have Revenge of the Sith, Incredibles, Civil War... And X-Men Days of Future Past on the same service all at once. Revenge of the Sith is my favorite movie of all time and favorite Star Wars movie of all time. Incredible is my favorite Pixar movie, favorite animated movie, and one of my favorite movies of all time. Civil War, one of my favorite movies of all time, my favorite superhero movie of all time. And then Days of Future Past is my favorite X-Men movie of all time. So I've been waiting for this day, and I just I just can't wait. I can't wait for this because it's, it's, just, it's just awesome. X-Men on Disney Plus, it's finally here. Also, Solo, A Star Wars Story, one of the best Star Wars movies, and I think the best Disney-era Star Wars movie, so underrated, makes Solo 2 happen. That's all awesome that is finally coming to Disney+. Plus. And there's not really anything of note to me until July 31st, where there's two things, and they're both really big things for me. First, Incredibles 2. I love Incredibles 2. It's the sequel to my favorite animated movie of all time, and a not disappoint. Incredibles 2 is fantastic. I love that movie. But more importantly, and more excitedly for me, Muppets now. I love the Muppets and it's stunk having really no Muppets content for the past X amount of years. Finally, we're getting Muppets again and I'm so excited for that. I can't wait to watch that show. So those are the notable things for me in July, but let me know in the comments, guys, what for you is the most anticipated thing for July when it comes to Disney+. Plus. And our second topic here comes from Stephen Knox and he says, if you're able to, can you find out when the trailer for season two is coming? So, unfortunately, we can't find out exactly when because they haven't filmed yet. They haven't finished filming yet. I was informed on the in the comments of the previous episode that they stopped filming in mid-March. 
and they haven't gone back since. Some of the cast is going back soon though it sounds like, so it sounds like they will be filming again very soon. But unfortunately, because filming was delayed for so long, I don't think we can expect one, the season to come out on time, and two, because of that, I don't think we can expect the trailer to come out on time. If everything was going as usual, and if everything went as planned, and if everything was filmed already, I would say we should expect the trailer to come in August, because that's when the Mandalorian Season 2 trailer is coming. But unfortunately, I think it'll be a little bit later. I think the Season 2 trailer for High School Musical and the Musical series is going to come out either late September, early October, because I don't think the show is going to come back until probably November, December, unfortunately. I, I, I hope I'm wrong. I really hope it comes sooner. Like I said on the last episode, I love this show. You guys can probably tell that I love this show, and I wanted to come back as soon as possible, but unfortunately, I just don't have a good feeling about it. I have a feeling we need to wait a little while for the next season and for the trailer, unfortunately, which really sucks, and I hate it. But unfortunately, I think that's going to be the most likely scenario. If we get any other news, though, if we get any update on the trailer, I will make sure to keep you guys updated. I'll let you know right away because I'm going to definitely stay as updated on this show as I possibly can. But unfortunately, we can't know for certain when the trailer is going to be. And I don't think it'll come until probably September, October. But when do you think the show is going to come, guys? Let me know in the comment section down below. Bit of a shorter episode today. Like I said, there's not really much Disney news. So that's where you come in. Let me know in the comments, guys, any and all topics Disney-related that you want me to cover on the future episode of Disney at Dawn. As you can tell, we kind of need them because there's really nothing going on right now Disney-related, so we need your topics. Let me know in the comment section down below. Anything Disney-related would be greatly, greatly appreciated. Also, let me know any way I can improve this show and make it more enjoyable. And feel free to subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss any of my future episodes every single day at 8 a.m. Eastern. Have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching, and hopefully I will see you next time.